Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufazuka channel with GW3D 3D modeling basic tutorial. Today I will create a simple cable tray. First uh, we can create a new part. And next uh, I will create sketch and can choose uh, this uh, green plan. You can click OK. The next in here I will draw a line object. Okay, you can draw uh, like uh, this uh, form. And then I will uh, use uh, quick dimension to change uh, distance for uh, this uh, lens into 50 ok, we change again a length for this line object into 100 ok, now uh, we can use a uh, filler command to fill uh, in here with uh, radius 3 you can uh, click uh, scatter tab and then use uh, filler command ok, you can uh, click here and then click fillet I will set for radius into 3 for first cube, we can split in it, and second cube in it. The next, we can fill it at uh, this point. Okay, uh, click in here, and then click here. You can click apply. Now, uh, you can close sketch. And the next, uh, I will uh, create a new circle object in the top of uh, this uh, lens object. You can click sketch, and then I will uh, click uh, this option. We can use uh, insert then tool. You can click at uh, this point. Okay. Now for offset, I will set into zero, and you can click OK. OK again to apply. We can draw circle object in uh, this plane. You can click circles and then click at uh, this point. Okay, you can also can orbit uh, this model and then click at this point. For radius, I will set into 2,5. OK, you can close sketch. The next, uh, we can create a new sketch again, and then I will use uh, this uh, green plan. You can click apply. Okay, I will create circle objects. Okay, you can create in here. We create again a uh, circle in here. Okay, you can create in the right here. And then we can create in the bottom here. Okay, for radius, uh, we can set into 2,5. You can click apply. You can use a quick dimension to change a distance from the center point into here. You can set in here into 3. And then I will set again from this point into this point. Uh, sorry, I can click in here and then click at this point. And then you can move to the top. I will set into 5. Okay. Now uh, we can set from the center point into here into 23. In the right here, we can set again, okay, into this point of 5, and then for a distance in here, we can set into 3, okay, this is already 3, you can undo. Now, uh, we can change again uh, for a distance from the center point into here, into 48, and then from the center point into this uh, line objects. I okay, will set in here into 26 and OK. Now uh, you can uh, change uh, from this point into here into 5. And you can close uh, this gap. To convert into 3D models, I will use a sweep command. You can click here sweep and then you can click at uh, the circles. And for path 2, we can select at uh, these uh, objects. OK, you can click OK, apply. Next, uh, I will copy with uh, pattern these uh, models. Okay, you can uh, click uh, basic editing and click pattern. You can use uh, this uh, option uh, linear. And for base, I will uh, click uh, this object, uh, sweep a base. Now, uh, for a number, I will set into 6. For spacing, I will set into 50. Okay. And then for direction in here, we can set into Y axis. Okay, you can click here for Y axis. You can click OK to apply. Now uh, we can use the extrusion command to extrude uh, this uh, circle objects. You can click extrude. And in here for profile, you can select uh, this profile. And I will extrude uh, into minus uh, 252,5. And uh, like uh, this for extrusion, and you can click apply. Now uh, we already create uh, this uh, simple 3D model cable tray with uh, GW3D software. Okay, if you have any question about this uh, tutorial, you can comment below this video.